Hi, in this screencast we're going to talk about setting mouse cursor style. Uh, CSS allows you to set your cursor style when you move your mouse over an element where the cursor style has been set. Uh, for example, you can change your cursor into something other than pointer uh, when you mouse over an anchor tag. Okay, so let's look at how to do it. Uh, I'm gonna open up top style from my desktop and then I'm gonna start a new HTML file okay and then inside my file I'm gonna set a div uh, let's do an anchor tag okay please click me okay and then do href uh, let's do nothing, okay? And uh, let's just do inline style here, like that, okay? And in here, click out, click in, okay? So I'm gonna use the inline style inspector here, and let me drag it down and you'll see cursor right here okay and let's do this and look at our options so we can inherit from uh, whatever default is or whatever our parent was set to or make it auto which is the default value uh, we can do crosshair uh, default okay and pointer uh, and there are a lot more which I don't usually use okay uh, what I've used the most is changing between default and pointer so we know that if you mouse over uh, a, a tag okay it changes your mouse from an arrow to a pointer right so if we leave this like this um, when you mouse over this area it's going to change to pointer but let's change it to crosshair and see what it looks like okay let's save it and let's save it in our desktop CSS let's save it as index.html okay save and let's minimize it open up our CSS folder and then view this in our browser okay so now uh, because I've set the style to crosshair so right now when I mouse over you won't be able to see pointer instead you'll see crosshair like this you see okay and you can change it to something else to default which is arrow okay let's try that click on here and then change to default save minimize bring back Firefox refresh now if I mouse over it's as if it's not clickable okay so uh, you can play around with uh, oops wrong one you can play around with a setting cursor style. You can set it in set a class and apply a class to many different elements. Okay, or you can set uh, a tag style, and so all the tags within the the page will have that same setting. Okay, so that's it for this screencast. Thank you very much.